All right, on my uh, 2013 Ford Fusion, I had the front uh, lamp burn out that's closest to the grill. Um, it was this bulb here. Um, and I replaced it with an LED, and I thought it was going to be a pretty difficult job where uh, you have to take the front face off because it seems like uh, when you read the owner's manual, um, you have to uh, take it in for service to get that bulb replaced. But it really wasn't that, that bad. There's an access cap. Once you get that off, it's kind of a tight fit, but you can get your hands up in there and pull the socket out and replace the bulb. And I replaced it with an LED like this. And, and the passenger side was pretty easy. We're gonna try the driver's side and see if, see if it's just as easy. I just replaced in there and let's hit unlock here so when you hit unlock it's one of the bulbs that comes on closest to the grill so it's that one there that's the LED that I just replaced in there and the way you do it is there's a rubber seal, a round rubber seal that I just shown, that you pull that off, you kind of reach up to the, towards the grill, and you just pull it out and replace the bulb. We're going to try it on the driver's side. So, so here's the one that's on the driver's side, it's back behind here, and we're just going to pull this rubber access, it's just a round rubber access it's got two little tabs on it and I might have to grab a pair of pliers to do this but it kind of seals up around there you just kind of work it loose and then it looks like this and it just it gives you an opening to get back up in there and you don't have to take any, everything apart. Come on back there, a little too close. So you have to just reach your hand, There's some. you'll feel some wires in there. And go ahead and look down into the headlamp here. It's the bulb that's closest in there. When you feel the wiring harness going to it, you'll see it kind of loosen up. And you're just going to pull straight back with your fingers on the wiring harness. And that bulb should come right out of the socket. Okay, you can stop it here. So with your hand in that round hole, just get a couple fingers on the wire and you'll see the bulb can move and just pull it back. And if you do replace it with another bulb and not an LED, you're going to want to make sure you don't really touch the bulb. Uh, but we're going to use an LED. And re so here's the LED I'm going to replace. Actually, it was a bulb, and now we're putting that LED in there. With that access cover off, you can just push it right back in.